All right, guys, so today is day three of shots. Today is day three of shots. And yesterday was so freaking hectic. Um, I think I updated you guys, but if I did not, um, I spent the entire day trying to get a hold of my nurse, the pharmacy, because I miscalculated my minute pier, of course. And I ran out. Um, Wednesday morning and so I knew I needed some for this morning which is a Thursday and I was not sure how I was gonna get it I found a lady on Facebook and she was nice enough to be like hey I have some extra if you need any I will you know let you take some so that was great um, so it did give me a little bit of peace of mind but I was able to get everything worked out my medication arrived this morning at 7 15 which was freaking awesome i didn't have to even miss my normal scheduled time so that was great um, i did have a blood test this morning to continue on with my plan so what they do is they give you like your dosage for the first three four days or whatever then you come in for a check and then they'll let you know how they want you to proceed so as of this morning, I took blood and they want me to continue with the same do dosage uh, through the rest of the week. So I'm gonna do that. And then I have like another checkup on Saturday. And yeah, everything's just kind of going as planned. I am happy to report today's blood test. I think my I was already at like 101 for my estrogen, which is really good, at least in comparison to last time. Um, so I am a little hopeful, but Again, I'm just taking everything day by day. So far, I don't really feel anything. My stomach is sore where I've like inserted the needles, but other than that, I'm fine. I'm just tired, and I don't even know if that's like it has to do with the medication. I'm just tired, assisted tired. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna go take my evening shot, and that's it. Talk to you later. Bye. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. I feel like I've been doing a lot of these just like really quick hop on hop off kind of clips um and i apologize i have not had time to just kind of like sit down and update you guys but here we are again and today is day i want to say day five of stims and i have my first uh, sonogram appointment since i've started shots so um, i'm gonna go do that it's not at my normal doctor's office i do have to drive a little ways so i am up fairly early this saturday morning but it is what it is um, as far as how I'm feeling, I think the medicine has just made me really tired. Um, so I am low key kind of worried that it's not even working because I'm not feeling how I feel like I should be feeling when your ovaries are like blowing up with eggs. I don't know. I feel like I should be more uncomfortable or more bloated. And I just, I just don't feel that right now. I just feel sleepy. So I don't know. Hopefully everything is good. I always get very... I don't, and I don't want to say nervous, but just like indifferent about these appointments because something, it's always something, you know, um, but we'll see. Fingers crossed that everything goes okay this morning. I don't have anything to share. Hopefully I have nothing terrible to share, nothing to share at all. Basically, it just goes according to plan and we can move on to retrieval next weekend. So I'll let you guys know. Talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so we are going to take our nighttime shots today. I did have my appointment earlier, which I think I talked to you guys about. Um, I did get an updated protocol today. It is day five. Um, after my scan, I was told I needed to add Cetratide into my protocol. Um, sorry if it's a little loud. I am currently at Grandma's house. My mommy's in town, so we're over here having dinner. And I brought my medicine because girls gotta do what a girl's gotta do. So. We are gonna take this Cetratide. I've never had it, and I'm kind of worried that it's gonna like burn or something, because I feel like I remember something about the Cetratide, but I'm not really sure what I remember, so hopefully this does not hurt.
Good morning, beautiful people. I am currently sitting outside of my doctor's office. I have another blood work and ultrasound appointment. It is stem day number nine. So I'm feeling actually pretty good. Um, I think this was an added uh, ultrasound appointment because my last one was, I think on Monday, um, they saw three fairly decent sized follicles um, and then they scheduled an additional ultrasound for Wednesday and Thursday. So I'm here this morning. I'll be back tomorrow. Um, as far as how I'm feeling with the shots and everything, I think I'm okay. Like, um, I don't really feel too much of anything. I feel a little gross. Um, I think that had a lot to do with me not being able to go to the bathroom. So I did have to take like, um, uh, what's it called? I, a colace yesterday just to kind of help me get everything going and moving because yeah these meds are no joke but other than that like I'm a little puffy in my stomach um but I don't feel that uncomfortable like I have some bruising where I do my um do my shots but yeah no I'm I'm feeling pretty good um I know in the beginning I told you guys I was really tired but right now day nine um other than my freaking bathroom issues everything is good um I don't know I'm a little bit nervous I feel like every appointment I I don't know I have like ultrasound PTSD or whatever so I don't really want to do this it's probably the worst part is these appointments and not the giving blood but the ultrasounds like I just hate going in there and doing ultrasounds. so I'm gonna go ahead and do this I have three minutes so I'm gonna go in there. I'm sure they're gonna want me to empty my bladder and like do whatever. So I'm gonna go do that. I will come back out and give you guys an update if there's anything to update you on. Um, I haven't been filming my shots as much because it's just the same thing every single day. Um, I know I did show you my Cetratide shot. That's the only addition to the Menopure and the Gonal F shot that I've been taking. So, whoops. So we'll see. I don't know what else is going to happen after today, but I will keep you guys posted. Talk to you soon.